A lot of people have been after this autograph. Ralph Harris says it was July 22nd, 1972, when he had an unusual so call to get up and go to work. At the time, he was one of the operators on a CP rail passenger train. When the locomotive left Medicine Hat, he never thought he'd get to meet the then Prime Minister at their stop in Calgary. Out of the private coach, Prime Minister Pierre Trudeau got out. Ralph says he was the only person who security introduced to Margaret Trudeau at the train station that day. He says Margaret was carrying seven-month-old Justin in her arms when she autographed his train order. She brought over her husband to do the same. They were both very nice. They were both cordial. They were real happy. Just ordinary people. Ralph's wife, Irene, says nearly three years ago, she heard Justin Trudeau was making a campaign stop in Lethbridge. At the time, he was vying to become the leader of the federal Liberal Party. So she dug up the old train order, hoping he'd sign it too. He came down to talk with the people. I just zoomed up there. <laughs> I gave him a quick little history on what it was and if he would sign it, and he said, sure. The couple says their autographed train order became even more special when Justin Trudeau was elected prime minister. I think it's kind of neat, interesting, um, something that is part of history. Now, he is the prime minister, so that gives me Pierre Elliott Trudeau, his mom, and Justin on the same page. The train order is kept in a folder at the Harris's home. While Irene says she's jokingly thought about selling it, Ralph there, wants there. to keep it in the family. I've hung on to that, that train order all these years. It's preserved, and I guess uh, I'll pass it on to my children. Taylor Osseen, CTV News, Lethbridge. Very, very few.